because it's still so new, there haven't been any published reports on how the virus affects pregnant women and children. But the CDC and doctors are still concerned. 7 Action News reporter Simon Chowdhury talks with doctors about the risks. The CDC says older people and people with underlying health issues seem to be hit a little harder when it comes to the coronavirus. But what about children and pregnant women? This is a very bad germ. Plain and simple. Dr. Kurt Wharton is the medical director of the Family Birth Center at Beaumont Hospital. He says pregnant women are at a higher risk when it comes to COVID-19. That's because this virus can make it harder to breathe, especially when the mom-to-be is further along in the pregnancy. If her lungs become sick, it's extremely difficult for her to recover. It's extremely difficult for us, even here in the hospital, to help her get better. Dr. Wharton is telling his pregnant patients to wash their hands, work from home if they can, don't plan on traveling, and don't be around crowds. Am I going to avoid elevators? Every chance I get. Not many studies have been done just yet when it comes to the coronavirus and pregnant women. But health experts believe the virus does not move from mom to baby and does not cause birth defects. Once the baby is born, the baby is then at risk if the mother is sick. But what about kids? Much less children are being reported at all, all around the world. Many of the kids who were diagnosed had a more mild illness. Beaumont pediatrician Dr. Daniel Schnarr suggests parents teach their kids about washing their hands properly. He says it's still safe to send them to school unless told otherwise by officials. But you may want to rethink extracurricular activities, especially if it's indoors. Perhaps, you know, play outside as the weather warms up rather than sitting in a movie theater. And if you think you might have the coronavirus, don't just head to your doctor's office or an ER. Call ahead of time to make sure they have the capability of administering a test or they can put you in the right direction. That way you're not coming in and getting other folks potentially sick. In Novi, I'm Simon Chowdhury for 7 Action News. Certainly good advice. Thank you so much, Simon.